After starting the software, open detection data when the data appears. Check the overall waveform first. If a pair collects multiple sets of data and the obtained waveforms are almost the same, it proves that the test process is qualified. We take a set of data as an example to analyze. We'll show how the data is processed. So add all the data of the current pile, then check the DC offset integral button, select the filter mode as low, and set the frequency to 2000. Since the reflection of the pile bottom of this waveform is not obvious, we can click the set button to adjust the waveform display height pixels to 350, the maximum can be 500. Then the waveform becomes bigger and clearer. Usually, if the reflection at the bottom of the pile is not obvious, we can click Amplification to select the type and multiple, usually select Index, and the magnification is adjusted according to the data, but do not set the multiple too large, because with the amplification of the waveform, defects will also be enlarged. For smoothing P, we can set it according to the waveform, which can remove some of the noise collected during detection, and then the waveform will become smoother. Then redetermine the pile head and pile bottom according to the waveform. Clicking wavelet can also filter the waveform, but don't overdo it. Next is an introduction to the functions of fixed rotation and positional rotation. The function of fixed rotation is to place the waveform of the selected position to the center line position. Positional rotation is to rotate the waveform with the selected position as the center.
If the user needs to reconfirm the pi length and the actual wave speed, please redetermine the positions of the pi head and the pi bottom according to the processed waveform, and then the actual wave speed in the detection can be obtained.